from StanfordAdvocate.com, Department of Justice broadens case against Julian Assange. The Department of Justice outlined new evidence Wednesday to bolster its case against Julian Assange in an updated indictment that accuses the WikiLeaks founder of soliciting hackers to break into the Icelandic government's computers to steal information that could be leaked to embarrass the government. And you go, what's the real charge here? Oh yeah, embarrassing the government. FBI agents and prosecutors in Manhattan were close to making a criminal hacking case against WikiLeaks based on these allegations in 2011, but were blocked by senior officials who wanted to focus on an espionage case against Assange in Virginia, according to people familiar with the matter, who spoke on the condition of anonymity because they were not authorized to speak publicly about an investigation. The Obama administration ultimately decided not to pursue the espionage case because of First Amendment concerns. It was revived under Trump over the objections of some prosecutors involved. The superseding indictment does not add to the 18 charges accusing Assange of working with former Army Private Chelsea Manning in 2010 to steal classified documents from the U.S. government. The statute of limitations for the new allegations has expired, but the document adds evidence to the government's assertion that Assange is not a publisher or a journalist, but a hacker. Now, Assange is still in the U.K. currently fighting extradition. And I bet if the government had put as much effort behind fixing the problems that Assange has been pointing out as they have in going after him in WikiLeaks, those problems would be solved by now. But no, that would ruin the point because Assange is pointing out evil and corruption in a system that is operating as designed to rip people off. Yeah, of course it's going to try to defend itself from people like him trying to embarrass the government into changing perhaps. But really, being government means never having to say you're sorry. Government has no shame and it can't be embarrassed into doing anything without the people who make it possible paying attention to people like Julian Assange and what they're pointing out as fundamental truths about the corruption of this system. So free Assange, if you're not a member of a group uh, uh, doing something, uh, I was very honored to participate in a lot of free Assange visuals over the last few months. So please check that out, get involved, do something, sign a petition, get your name on a list to make the government know that you know who Julian Assange is.